commissioners will decide whether to spend splossed money for upgrades at the Macon Centerplex. I found out what the upgrades are and how much it's going to cost. First we knew we had to improve the facilities. All signs point towards Macon Bib Commissioners approving $175,000 for basketball related upgrades at the Centerplex. It's going to allow us to have the flexibility to do more than just Globetrotters or more than just GHSA, which we're looking forward to. The facelift has been near the top of the county's list since the Georgia High School Association moved the state basketball finals away from the Centerplex in 2016. We had to get a new basketball court, we had to get new basketball hoops. Uh, the ones that we had here had, had been here for 20 years or so, uh, so that was our number one priority. The county quickly hired Spectra to manage the venue, and with promises of improving the Centerplex, GHSA announced in September it's coming back. Once we got GHSA to come see what we've been doing, uh, that's when we had them hooked. Up for a vote, $117,000 for a state-of-the-art basketball floor, and no more than about $58,000 for three basketball goals. It's going to allow us to set up the court and take it down a lot faster. Commissioners are expected to approve. Uh, we've got a great relationship with the commissioners, uh, the mayor and their staff uh, to keep attracting big name acts to come to Macon. Meaning Spectre can continue with its to-do list. You know, you're, you're going to see a more efficient lighting system which is going to uh, help us on the utility costs as well. Making the Centerplex a place Macon can be proud of. The Centerplex is also planning to install new lights, which will cut back on those utility costs.